Hi, I'm Max Gray, the owner and art gallery curator of Rusted Jade Art Collective on Florida's Adventure Coast. So Rusted Jade has been open for about a year and a half. Uh, it will be two years in July. Uh, my husband and I moved here from New York uh, exactly two years ago. And he is a tattoo artist and I am a photographer. And we've always said we wanted to open a business together, but it was kind of just a funny little joke. We never knew we could ever come together with our art. Um, and we decided to take a risk and open up our own tattoo shop with an art collective attached to it. Um, and we thought it was something different and that it would appeal to a much larger demographic than just a tattoo or art community. We really try to market a lot of what our brand and business is surrounding basically anyone that has some sort of art interest or art business in the community, not just Brooksville or Hernando County, but really anywhere in Florida, honestly, and that we are primarily a family-oriented place because we want everyone to feel comfortable coming here. Uh, and we really believe that art is for everyone and anyone. So we try to really market looking for artists that are professional, budding artists, hobbyists, kids. We do lots of workshops. Uh, our, we have a bunch of professional artists that will teach workshops. So that brings in a whole bunch of people that would maybe normally not be exploring art as something serious, but something fun. And maybe it's something that they want to, you know, sh start doing and start showing. Uh, our art gallery as, you know, as much as we want it serious and really, um, you know, taken seriously with lots of very high quality professional artists. We also want it to be a place where anyone can grow into an artist as well. So lots of social media marketing, lot of, lots of word of mouth. Um, that's pretty much how we do it. We just try to really connect with the people that live in and around here. We really pride ourselves in focusing around the social aspect of art. So we call ourselves a social club where art speaks. Basically, if you're an artist or someone that loves art or someone that knows someone that does art, and that's where the tattooing comes in as well as that being a very historical form of art, we are basically welcoming everyone in here to enjoy it as a social atmosphere as well. People can come in and work on their laptops, they can network with other artists, they can come in and work on paintings or drawings. Uh, there's plenty of people that rent the space for workshops, you know, whether it's a crafter or art, any type of art. We also have uh, coffee at the collective, at our art collective on Wednesdays. So that's another social aspect, like the hospitality aspect of it. Just the people that come in to get coffee will sometimes sit, hang around, chat, and they wind up taking a class, buying something, booking a tattoo. So that's really what the nucleus of our business is, is really a social atmosphere centered around art. And I really truly believe art is for everyone. So that's the biggest part of our brand. Tattooing to us is really rooted in honor and tradition and the history of tattooing, which means we're giving a full experience to our client. You know, these are people's forever on them basically that's that's just the the art that's forever on their body and it's also part of what's happening between the artist and the person receiving the tattoo during the session that really means a lot to us too so it's really a unique experience that we're providing as just a tattoo shop not just an, an art shop so for us we wanted to make sure that our artists were all versatile in different styles uh, they had a deep understanding of providing uh, an experience and an optimal service, not just the product of the tattoo for our client, as well as being rooted in art first. All of our tattoo artists are artists first. So it's a lot more than just picking up a tattoo machine and putting ink on skin for us. So the tattooing aspect is really, like I said, rooted in art. And that's where, that's why that was basically the foundation of us starting the whole art collective aspect, because it's more than just a tattoo or just a specific medium of art. So our tattoo shop is, you know, our, our number one priority when it comes to 
serving our clients. We get a lot of people that come in that want cover-ups or want to just find a new artist because they weren't being given an experience that was necessary. My husband, Lenny, is the head senior artist here. He's been tattooing for about 10 years. He was classically trained by two of New York City's best tattoo artists and he takes a lot of what he's learned from them and applies it not just with tattooing but with customer service as well and the experience he's providing. You know, his biggest thing is I don't have to be the greatest tattoo artist but I have to be the best at serving the best experience. That's what keeps people coming back and keeps them coming through the door. Even though I would like to say that we probably are the best <laughs> and we do want to be the best. At the end of the day, it's about providing that optimal experience for people. And Lenny is a driving force in why all of the artists at our shop do provide that experience. It's about connecting with people, building relationships, and always doing right by people. With tattooing, as well as with just servicing the customer. And what's really cool about that is a lot of people learn that it, from the whole tattoo aspect, that it can build into something so much more in the arts community that it's not really taboo anymore. Tattooing isn't that weird thing that only criminals get tattoos, that whole aspect. So we're trying to really break barriers there and you know erase the stigma of tattooing being a negative thing and it being pretty much for everyone as long as we're honoring the traditions and we're doing right by people in the right aspects. What's really unique about our shop is not just that it's a tattoo shop and an art collective and gallery, but it's a celebration of family. The people that work here and that are part of the collective, it's not like some rigorous process to get here. It's more of how we connect with each other, coming in person and meeting us, and how like the energy flows. I think that's what keeps us you know, really moving along and providing something really unique is that we're all pretty much a big family. So for us, having the collective of artists really enmeshing well with us, even though, like I said, it's a place for anyone, we all have to work together and get along really well. And that's what creates the inspiration for creating, essentially, is where all artists can kind of come together and they just get more and more inspired by each other and they grow as artists and same with our tattoo artists we all come together and we look at each other's work and we give constructive criticism and each artist grows together because we are family and we're honest with each other and i think that's what makes it really a unique place to be we're always looking for people to join the collective throughout the year so if you were interested in showcasing your work here being part of a gallery show you can visit us on our website, on Instagram, on Facebook, or TikTok. You can reach out to us directly there. And you can, of course, learn more about us and what we're about. And we are always welcoming everyone to come and drop in whenever they would like as well. Bring your friends, bring your family. We'd love to meet you.